Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, you're welcome. My name is Elle and this is a channel where you'll find food, fashion and DIY dish talk to you step by step. Today I want to share how I crochet my hair to look like this. So if you're interested in this video, please stay tuned. So the first thing is to get our braid pattern down. I am going to have some leave out at the front and a part which you will see. So I am just going to flat twist it all down so that it doesn't get in the way. And here is the side parting. The braid pattern I will be doing is simple straight back, nothing complex. At the back, I take the ends of the cone row and weave it into another like this. This way allows me to tuck all my ends in except for the last one which I will crochet into, well crochet it down so that it doesn't stick out. So here I'm just using my crochet needle to tuck in the last hair but you can equally use a needle and thread to make sure that the hair doesn't stick out. This is the hair I'm using, it's called Mali Braids, I have mine in colour too. It comes in one bundle and it's already in pieces which makes it easy to use. So here I am just checking what length to go for. Okay let's try a shorter length. Mm, that looks 
quite short let's stretch it slightly mm, yeah that is still short yeah long it is so what I do for my crochet hair is this I take one piece of hair grab the latch hook pass it under the braid like this grab the hair and glide it and close the latch pull it through carefully remove the needle then grab half of the hair and pass it through the loop to secure the hair you don't have to worry about the hair slipping out because it has a kinky texture to it so as you can see I only knot it once and I'm good to go You will notice that the crochet hair is slightly spaced out. This is deliberate because I want to create a natural look. Wow, this went by really, really fast. This is two packs of hair. Look at the full hair, y'all. Look at the full hair. So now I am just unraveling the flat twist and I'm going to blend it with the crochet hair. While you're here, if you're liking this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more hair videos like this. My hair color and the crochet hair matches really well, so close. Like I'm blending into it and it looks like my hair. Look at that. I mean, I can't even tell which is my hair from the extension. It's just perfect. So this is the final look. It took me about an hour to do both the conroe and the crochet. Don't forget to subscribe if you like to see more videos like this. I also have videos on food, fashion and DIY so please be sure to check those out. You can also follow me on Instagram at allthingswithl. Thank you so much for watching this video. I'll see you on my next one. Bye for now.